from the courts now. A Yaba Chief Magistrate Court has ordered the remand of a dismissed police officer, Sergeant Samuel Phillips, over the murder of a teenager at her home. Chief Magistrate Adeola Adedaya remanded the 30-year-old dismissed officer pending the legal advice from the Office of the Director of Public Prosecution, DPP. Kemi Foladeyemo reports. Before Samuel Phillips was presented in court, the officer had been dismissed from the Nigeria Police Force following the conclusion of his orderly room trial. This was contained in a statement released by the police public relations officer in the state, Adekunle Ajishibutu. During Friday's brief proceedings, police prosecutor Augustin Nwabuisi applied for the remand of the accused for 30 days, pending an advice from the director of public prosecution for the murder trial to be heard at the High Court instead which has the jurisdiction to hear charges relating to capital offences, including homicide. Though the magistrate court didn't take the plea, he is alleged to have committed the offence on September the 10th. The charge sheet also states that the incident took place at about 11.30 p.m. at No. 5 Mogaji Street at Ijechatedo area of Lagos State, and that Phillips, while in the criminal raid, unlawfully released gunshots into the house of one Monsura to Jade, aged 18 years, hitting her two thighs, which led to her death, end quote. The defendant was represented by Doni Shobi, while lawyer for the Ujwade family was also present in court. Among several issues raised in the police handling of the case, the family wants the authorities to change the stray bullet narrative as to how the deceased died. Nobody ever made it clear to us what the outcome of the early trial of the police, which we attended. We are get, 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 getting the report just now that he has been dismissed. They are wrong. Because of the sudden nature of the invitation, of the information, my clients couldn't make it. Remember they are in the morning. I can't call them by 10 p.m. and say be in court by 9 a.m. in the morning. The truth must be spoken. Today it is Monsieur of Ajuade. Tomorrow I could be the next Monsieur of Ajuade. You could be the next Monsieur of Ajuade. Jumoka's case is still there. A whole lot of people have been felled by bullets from the people that we pay with our taxpayers, ta taxpayers' money. It is unacceptable. And we demand that these narratives should change. Now that we have charged her officially, I uh, charge him with murder. We demand that the stray bullet narrative should be corrected. The commissioner of police was at her residence on, on, on last Monday with a condolence letter. In the condolence letter, they still refer to the bullet as stray bullets. We said, no, sir, it is not fair to the memory of this girl. Further hearing is fixed for October the 25th. Kemi Foladiemo, TVC News, Lagos.